He's a full-time student, a father of four, and the oldest player on the kangaroo football team. I'm out there running with them and, and doing the drills and everything. And I think that's added to their respect for me because they know I haven't tried to cut any corners. At 61 years old, Tom Thompson says he's kicking at old school. My football paradigm is 40 years old. I played high school football. I was a backup kicker, so I actually had to learn how to kick all over again. He gets to the training room an hour and a half before football practice starts to begin his warm-up and kicks a few over the goal post before the rest of the team is even out on the field. He's worked hard at it and he's gone through a lot of hard work and, and, and a, lot of, a lot of pain to, to get, you know, to be able to do this. And even though he's old enough to be their father, the guys on the team say he's just like one of their own. I was, just, I was kind of surprised I've never heard of it before, but that was kind of interesting. So what's it been like now? Um, used to it. It's pretty cool. I mean, I literally have good friends 40 years younger than me. And I mean, how do you how do you how do you do that? And Thompson's hard work and training from last year and into this season will be put to the test on Saturday. It's a big game, and you know we're gonna try to get him in, let him kick. He may not live to see his next birthday if he misses, so he might want to think about it before he goes in there. No matter what happens on this Saturday's game. Tom Thompson says he's already won in the game of life. His goal of making the team wasn't the fulfillment of a long lost dream from his college days. Even when we're older, we can have a place of relevance. I mean, if you talk to my teammates, they'll, they'll tell you I'm, I'm just one of them just because I've learned from them and uh, I'm, I've actually grown from having been around them. So for Thompson and the rest of the kangaroo football team, the journey has made this season one they'll never forget. In Sherman, Maddie Garrett, First News.